today we are going to show you uh, how to program active tags and how to uh, work with uh, an RFID reader in our RFID configurator. I will be explaining and Dima will be helping me if something happens which I don't know. So first we open uh, the RFID configurator. It's important to notice that during the whole programming process, we need to connect the RFID talk, RFID reader, sorry, to RS485 USB adapter, like this, or any other, the very cheap versions, they are good in their functionality. But we use actually this adapter only to program yes. the RFID reader, okay, if make. you want to program it, okay. We are connecting mm -hmm. the device. Uh, the first step in the whole configuration is to choose right ADM20 reader, RFID reader address. Uh, basically, uh, it is equal to one, mm -hmm. but in our case, it's five. Okay. We are starting to read all the information that uh, the reader receives. Now you can see in the first lines that we received TAC signal, mm -hmm. ADM21 RFID TAC. There are several TACs in its range, yeah. I suppose, yeah, yeah. right. Okay. With the different periods. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now we can, for example, try to read the card. Okay. Yeah. And the number of the card? is in UID. Uh-huh, okay. For example, again, this card. Okay, again. I did it again. The general concept of ADM20 settings is presented here in this window. Mm -hmm. Here we can change the address, mm -hmm. subnets that we are listening to and mm -hmm. receiving signal from. Um, also, Mm -hmm. We are able to update the firmware. Okay. And uh, ADM21. So actually, this is the RFID tag, and it's active. And here we can program the period yes. of data transmission. Yeah. Yes, for example. For the RFID tag, because this is the big difference uh, which our tags have in comparison with passive RFID tags, which you can't program. Here you can set the period. Uh, of data transmission, notifications, and it's really important because not only the RFID reader only pulls mm -hmm. and uh, searches for, for the tags, uh, the active RFID tags will be uh, notifying and transmitting data to the reader themselves. Yeah, this is basic parameters. During the Xenia speech you could see the information here Mm -hmm. that we connected a tag ser with serial number many, okay. many nulls and eight. Okay. And before you could see an errors that I tried to mm -hmm. um, somehow show you. This may happen because you place the magnet mm -hmm. required for turning the tag into configuration mode um, in the wrong place. Mm -hmm. You should make it strictly according to this picture mm, okay uh, here we can change id number we can change subnet strength period and so on for example we what is strength the strength of the signal a uh, strength of the signal yeah, okay the yeah. bigger it is mm -hmm, mm -hmm. The more, more strong more okay coverage. strong or weak signal yeah. okay Understood. Okay. We can, for instance, put it 